We'll catch up with UNA defensive coordinator Stedman Campbell here in this Lion Vision update. Spring football coming to a close this week with the spring game scheduled for Saturday. And Coach Campbell, it's kind of weird to say defensive coordinator. The last couple years of the offensive coordinator, you moved to the other side of the field coaching the defense. So far in spring, what's it been like making that jump? Well, I think it's been an easy transition. Uh, you know, having Blake Ferris and, and, and Gabe Poe and – Jack Gilmore, our, our graduate assistant, you know, those those guys have, have, have been good for me. You know, we've been really good on that side side of the ball. It's kind of my job just not to mess anything up. So I've enjoyed the transition. And, you know, I've always been, you know, I kind of grew up on the defensive side, you know, when my dad was coaching and started out as the GA and even my first two years here as a, a, on the defensive side. So it's it's been good to kind of get those that, – that, that part of the, you know – thing going as, as far as just getting your blood flowing, your juices going on the defensive side. So I've enjoyed it. It's been, I think, an easy tra transition, and I look forward to it. On that side of the ball, a, a scrimmage at the end of last week, Coach, uh, what did you like? Maybe who were some players that stood out? Well, the best part about it is there were some very, uh, very coachable moments. Uh, you know, we by no means um, – you know, played our best. You know, we left a lot of um, – didn't make a lot of plays. We're out of our gaps a, a lot of times. It's just a lot of – a lot of um, um, you know situations that, that that we can improve in. Um, you know, I thought you know as far as people that, that that stood out on the defensive front, Aquarian Harris had a really good day. I thought Joshua Monfo at linebacker had a good day and, and, and has really had a whole you know a, a good good spring in in general. Um, and in the back end, you know, David Swin made made some good plays. He's one of our new players. Uh, we've kind of played him at corner and safety, and uh, did some really good things. So you know, there's there's guys you know getting better. They're improving. We've just kind of got to keep push through this this last week. You know, use every practice, um, you know, as an opportunity to get better as a as as a player and a unit. And that's what I expect us to do. Spring game this Saturday, uh, final go, last practice will be Saturday uh, at Brawley Stadium. So what are you guys wanting to accomplish? What do you want to see? Well, you know, we're going to try to play as base as we can. You know, my as, as a coach, I just want to see, you know, who's – Who's going to make a play? You know, we haven't done a very good job with, with turnovers this spring. That's a credit to the offense. But, you know, we're just going to try to, you know, line, line them up as, as, as base as we can. Who's going to run to the ball? Who's going to make a play? Uh, who kind of stands out? You know, we're not going to do anything exotic or anything like that. So, uh, you know, those are the things that, that, that we're looking at. Who's, you know, doing their job? Who's in their gap? You know, who who has, you know, mental mistakes, alignment issues, you know, all, all, all those things. So, you know, it's just uh, one last day. Hopefully it's a great crowd. I think the weather's going to be nice. But, um, you know, it's just, you know, one last practice, you know, to, to get people on the field in a scrimmage situation and, and really kind of find out, you know, who's, who's going to make a play for us and who isn't. One last practice this Saturday, the spring game, 10 a.m. at Brawley Stadium. We hope to see you out.